The LBX is 4,190 mm, 165 inches long, 1825m, 71.8 in wide, and 1,545 mm, 60.8 in tall, while having a wheelbase of 2,580 mm, 101.5 in. Riding on 18-inch wheels is standard equipment. The Petite Lexus is actually slightly bigger than the Yaris Cross and tips the scales at 1,280 kilograms, 2,821 pounds. It will be offered with a choice between front and all-wheel drive, with all configurations coming exclusively with a continuously variable transmission. At the heart of the LBX is a hybrid powertrain based around a three-cylinder, 1.5-liter gasoline engine. It produces a combined output of 134 horsepower, 100 kilowatts, and a maximum torque of 185 newton meters, 136 pound feet. It's enough electrified punch for a 0 to 62 miles per hour, 100 kilometers per hour, run in 9.2 seconds and a maximum towing capacity of 750 kilograms, 1653 pounds. All versions of the latest Lexus get a McPherson strut front suspension while the rear uses a torsion beam for the FWD models and a double wishbone if you opt for AWD. Technical specifications for the latter have yet to be disclosed but we do know it will add an electric motor at the rear. Interestingly, the small crossover has an aluminum hood as well as molded resin wheel arches, rockers, and lower door sections to keep weight down. Stepping inside, the LBX boasts a 12.3-inch fully digital instrument cluster with an optional head-up display joined by a 9.8-inch touchscreen. The infotainment supports both Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, but only the former has wireless connectivity. Lexus has once again teamed up with Mark Levinson, which supplies the 13-speaker sound system that comes along with a subwoofer. Stick to the front-wheel drive model and you get a cargo capacity of 332 liters, 11.7 cubic feet, with the rear seats in place. The AWD-equipped LBX is likely to be less practical due to the extra hardware installed at the back. Lexus mentions it hasn't made any compromises in terms of quality and attention even though this is the new entry-level model. The LBX is the company's first model for which development primarily took place in Europe.